What's going on everybody? This is Nick in 07 with another video upon an application that I had quite a while back that I picked up. It's called Handbrake. What Handbrake is an application that lets you convert, or actually it was built for originally to burn any DVD into uh, any other format for your iPod, for iPod Touch, uh, for your iPhone, uh, also for PSP or in any other diff uh, different file formats. Um, so let's take a quick look at it. All right, so as you can see, I have it right here in my dock. There's Handbrake, it's little, um, it gets a little pineapple with a little kind of drink here, so we're gonna click on it. So, oh, let me close it up. So, like I said before, Handbrake was originally made uh, just to rip DVDs. So it's pretty simple to do. Uh, I have a DVD, as you can see over here, already in my uh, computer. So all you have to do is hit source, and then you can pick from different places right here. So you can pick, let's go pick The Guardian. That's what the DVD I have, and you can hit open. And you can see right here from, or it says source, it says scanning new source. So it's gonna go through the DVD, read, see uh, how many scanning titles there are, and it's gonna tell you, and it's gonna tell you really quick, you know, give you all your options for what you can do for ripping it. Now, as I said before, um, Handbrake was originally made for DVDs, but with the latest up update uh, for it, they made it to rip any type of file format. So it doesn't matter what it is now. So if you have a movie, maybe you downloaded online, or you have some type of video on your computer, and you wanted to rip it to a DVD format, now it will read any source. So you can read AVIs, uh, MPEGs, or whatever other type of video format you have, you can, uh, you can put in here, and it's gonna automatically convert into whatever you want. So as you can see right here, I already picked up the source, the Guardian, tells you the title, tells you how many chapters there are, chap chapters 1 through 13, the duration right here, tells you where the file, and right here gives you destination, where you want to put it. So of course you can just hit browse, and you can pick where you want to have it. Tells you uh, your picture settings, what you have over here, your video, your audio subtitles, chapters, advanced, and your, also your file format. Now over here on the side, you can hit toggle uh, presets. Now has uh, has four presets here for you. Has the basic presets, which it goes to normally. Then it also has presets for Apple, so Universal, iPod, I um, iPhone and iPod Touch, Apple TV, QuickTime. It also has high profile ones, so animation, film, television. It also has now for gaming consoles as well. So it'll do for your PSP, your PS3, and your Xbox 360. So, and like I said before, it does any file format now. So you can hit source, and let's go to a file format here. I already have, I have some movies already here ripped. You can see their AVI, and it actually lets you read. Before they'd be all grayed out, you wouldn't, you couldn't read AVIs or any type of other file format. So I can click on AVI really quick and hit open. It's gonna read it, and there it is. So there's AVI, and I can put it back if I wanted to. I could put it back into whatever other file I want. So if I needed one for my iPod, or I needed one for my, uh, iPhone or my iTouch, I can do it all right here really quick. So, um, to get Handbrake, it's pretty simple. Let's hide this really quick. You just have to go to your web browser, go to Safari here, and you can go Google. So, let's go to Google. Google.com. And just hit, type in Handbrake. And you're probably going to see it anyways. So, there it is the Handbrake. So, you, first link. So, you click on it. Here's the ha Handbrake website. So as you can tell, it's the Handbrake 0.9.3 uh, was released, and this um, and this will be for any ha uh, this, like I said for any file now. I mean for any file type. So you can do download it now, and it gives you different types. So it's good for it has it for uh, Mac, also has it for Windows, uh, Linux. Also has a source code down here for all platforms. Now it tells you which one you want. It tells you to uh, please download the GUI platform. The CV is only for suited adv for advanced. The CLI is only for advanced users. So you can just download right here the Intel Intel only the DMG right here, and it's only for Intel based uh, Max. So you can download the GUI right here. It doesn't take that long, and then you're ready to go with it. All right. So this has been Nikon 07 with another quick video on an application uh, called Handbrake. So if you guys so please subscribe if you guys have any questions. Leave a comment down below and also have a link to Handbrake in the sidebar. Alright, so see you see see you guys all later.